Hello, and welcome to another episode of my Coffee Break Art Classes. Here you'll find little snippets of information about well-known works of art. This video is about an artwork known as The Tent, made by Tracy Emin. Tracy Emin bought a small square blue tent, and inside on the floor she wrote, With myself, always myself, never forgetting. She then appliqued on the inside the names of 102 people that she had slept with up to the time of its creation, which included family, friends, drinking partners, lovers, even two fetuses. The tent was first exhibited in 1995 at the South London Gallery, and although she was unknown herself, she was fortunate to be able to exhibit alongside much better known artists at the time, such as Damien Hirst, Gilbert and George, and uh, Sarah Lucas. Charles Saatchi offered to buy the tent from her, but she refused him and sold it to Eric Frank for £12,000. He promptly sold it to Saatchi for £40,000. Saatchi exhibited the tent in the Sensation exhibition at the Royal Academy in 1999 and it was rumoured that he'd been offered £300,000 for it. In 2004, the tent was totally destroyed in a fire at an East London warehouse where Saatchi stored some of his stuff. The fire destroyed over a hundred more items, including works by Damien Hirst. But after the fire, the public and media reaction was not one of sympathy, but of mockery. Tracy herself claimed that the majority of the British public had no regard, no respect to what she and her peers were doing. After the fire, she was offered £1 million by the Saatchi Gallery to remake the tent, but she declined. Finally, an artist, Stuart Semple, collected burnt remains from the warehouse fireside and packaged them in eight plastic boxes, claiming that among the debris were fragments of the tent. He offered this assemblage to the Tate Gallery, but they rejected it. Thank you for watching this Coffee Break art class. I hope you enjoyed it. Please leave a comment and uh, click the subscribe button. See you next time.